Hello everyone, there's Lobby Designs here, and um, welcome to part three of my uh, demon tutorial, where I review every single uh, effector or demon in the order that they appear here. So the next one, of course, is uh, K Speed. Now this one is much like K Age. Um, it basically does it works on the exact same concept. Uh, concept, sorry, but instead of uh, instead of having the effect or deleting the particles at a certain frame or time in the timeline, this does it when the particles hit hit or reach a certain speed. So if we just put the minimum speed on one and have the max speed on twenty, and then we just hit simulate. So it does of course have a normal circle uh, emitter, and if we hit simulate, so at the moment the speed that they're going is two because that's what the emitter is set on. When they hit this plane, they are going to slow down, so they won't be two anymore. They'll be below one, so they are now deleting. So it has nothing to do with the plane. Um, I'll also demonstrate with this with a bit of uh, K, um, well, just gravity. Uh, I know this is a kind of a bit cheating, um, but well, I mean, I have to, I have to include this, um, even though it's a demon and. I'll have to review it at a later time, I guess, but I'll just have to do it now. So we'll put that on 15, and then with the uh, max speed on 12, if I hit reset and then simulate, you'll see that these particles are not deleting. So then I'll have to put the uh, max speed on to 7, and now they should delete, yeah. So all these particles are reaching the speed of 7 at this point, so that's why they're deleting there. Now, um, I hope that makes sense to you. Uh, but now we'll get on to the, um, the more interesting part of this demon. Uh, like I said, it's a lot like KH, so you have this little split option here. So if you just tick yes there, and then change the child to 5. Um, I was doing a bit of work with this before, and it does kind of bug out a bit. Um, I don't know how you can maybe control this. Um, but yeah, so if I just hit simulate, you'll see that when it hits this point, all these particles uh, erupt into children of their own. So, and then these ones, when they uh, go faster than 12 or less than 1, will also erupt into children of their own. And um, so it's just kind of like an infinite loop or cycle or whatever you want to call it. Um, but yeah, so that's basically the whole, uh, that's the whole demon uh, review of it. Um, and just remember to uh, like, subscribe, favorite, do whatever, tell your mates about me. I'm at uni at the moment, so um, I, like I could put out a video every, probably like every half an hour. But I won't do that because that will just kind of overcrowd you and I won't be uh, keeping you wanting more, I guess, if, if you want to call it that. Um, but... Also, um, I'm looking at maybe getting a desktop uh, because I've been talking to this guy and uh, he's just told me a bit uh, like specs and stuff. The specs on this computer are pretty good. Like it has a 320 gig solid state drive, which uh, cost me $700. Uh, as you guys may know, that they're actually three gig, uh, three dollars per gig. So I saved $200 on that. Um, I have 12 gig RAM. Um, with, uh, yeah, actually, I think I only have three RAM slots, so that was actually pretty hard to uh, get. Um, also, I have a 3.5 gigahertz overclocked. I don't know, I don't actually know what it's overclocked to. I just know that the original is 3.5. Um, but, yeah, so, um, if you, I have NVIDIA graphics. Um, many of you might say, oh, that's not compatible with Mac. But, basically, the only thing that my computer is Mac is the, uh, is the, keyboard or the shell and the operating system everything else is custom built so um, yeah just tell me mates about me and I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later